look, there's a real hubbub down here, and I can see racing cars and a lot of students. What's going on? Um, today we're hosting the regional final of the F1 in schools competition here at Hall of College. Um, and um, what, how did, so what's the Harvard College students doing? How have they got to this stage? Um, so some of our students from the college here, they've been spending the last few weeks and months um, creating a small racing car. Um, so they've got together as a team and they've covered lots of different things over the past few months to, to bring them to this point here where they get to put themselves up against some other schools and colleges. This looks like great fun and it looks like they're all very intense here. But what are the, it's just another boring question, education. What are the learning outcomes for your students here? Um, so the students here ultimately ends up in them racing cars together, but the, what they've went through to get here is focusing on some of the STEM subjects. Um, so they've had to design the cars from scratch, so there's some sort of research and investigation. They've had to go through some artistic routes to get the car designed how they want. They've done some mathematical calculations to, to work out the best features to have in the car and how aerodynamics works. They've also had to work as project managers and work together as a team. So it's a huge variation in skills that yeah. are, are the outcomes here. Are they, are they, but is it pupil centered? It's not you doing their job for them, it's them learning. Yeah, ab absolutely not. This is, this is an extracurricular activity. So they, they opt into this themselves. Um, they are not, it's not me giving them lessons on it as such. They've, they've chosen to do this project. They run it themselves, and they get to learn through doing it um, what it's like to work on a project like this in the real world. So, I mean, some of them will think, "Well, if I could design a little bit, maybe I could design a big racing car." Absolutely, they 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 have to manufacture these cars as well. So even though they've taken it through the design stage, they go through manufacturing as well. Some of the processes we use here in the manufacturing centre would replicate those that happen in the real world. But also, uh, well, this just looks like great fun. Yeah, it's awesome fun. They're, they're really enjoying it and we're looking forward to seeing how they get on today. Well, thank you very much.